Keep watching Charis TV. It's very important to look unto the word. Second Timothy 1 verse 7. Second Timothy 1 verse 7. Second Timothy 1 verse 7. Chapter 1 verse 7. Verse 7. Verse 7. Verse 7. I just want to congratulate you with different reasons why you are here. Some of you you are here for healing, here for deliverance, you are here for worship, you understand. Different reasons, but I will tell you next year. Uh, I will tell you next year. Just come. The process of Holy Spirit will tell you. Just, just give. Just, just read, Mama. It says, for God did not give us a spirit and of love and of sound judgment and personal discipline, abilities that result in a calm, well-balanced mind and self-control. Let's pray. Thank you, Lord, for this word in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Today, let's deal with our minds. Like dealing with my mind. Dealing with my mind. Until God helps us to understand that there are certain things that if they enter our minds, they will affect our destiny. There are things that we do not need. If we focus on them, our road will be called the sick. There are people that are on a journey that does not take them anyway. Because they are allowing, you know, thoughts and minds, are contrary to their destiny. The Bible says God didn't give us the spirit of timidity or cowardice. Timidity or cowardice. He gave us a sound mind. We need to understand the meaning of mind. Is when you are unable. You are an, you are able to be aware of surroundings. Awareness of your world is dealt in your mind. So therefore, if you are taking what is not important and put them in your mind where your consciousness brings you to the things you are related to. You can be in danger if you take the wrong things. Are you hear what I'm trying to say? We need to be very careful with our words. Your mind is always running. If you don't give your mind a work, it will, your, your attention will be taken. And you find that your consciousness is where you are not supposed to be awake. After this service, you need to guard your mind. Because otherwise you are going to be busy with things that really affect your destiny. I cannot talk about intellectual or intellect. Because faculty of consciousness. When I'm here, 
ke le mo ke tshwere mike ka mogwao my mind mo gopolo wa ka what it has been recorded din toche ngwa di lweng ke recordilwe ke is my destiny ke di leng ghatanong le buyo ba ka will come first di to tapile i don't know if you hear that nke tseba le ntwa i have to deal with them before i deal with what is ke tsontsho shumana le tsona before ke to shumana le tse di leng ka i'm beginning to learn that delay ke thoma o ithuta gore go tshiana ko ina a o ka nte is inside o ka gare ga lena because the moment when you begin to deal ka ba re ka nna ko yo thoma o shumana with the things and delay lady lo le o tshiana ko you can also find yourself delay le wena o ka te thola o nje o tshiana ko get to the direction of where god is or o fi the mo la modimo a o isang i don't know if you hear it i get the valent so you your consciousness you are not wena bo ba ba hao if it's awake on the things of righteousness ga go tsogile tabeng ya dilo tsa tuko it becomes easy to take your position as a child of go thomo ba bonolo go tsia siemo sa go jalo ka ngwana o modimo wa ye mama go swanetseng buyong bo modimo anya ka go ya go bona ke ba ba nganye ba ba ntwang reng ke a twa ke utwile but now delay jo no ta ba shi u tsia mako is when you know you have wrong things in your mind ke ge o na le dilo tse di seng tsona ka rame gopolo ya hao that affect your destiny tse di affect ang he bo yo ba lena because those things are there to Kar- cover your eyes not to see the hope that god has dilo tse di ti le go tswalela mathwale na re se ka bona kholofelo yela modimanya ka ngo le fa yona that's why the bible says that is why bible is re ara fi wa moya of dealing with fear wa o shumana le go tshaba Can you hear that? You have yeah, given a spirit. Refilwe moya mm of timidity. Moya wona wa o dudishe. Or cowardice. O ba itse wa o tshaba. When you see something you retreat. Ha o bona nto o no tshaba wa ra wa tshek ya toel. O ba no ya tshaba yo kopana le tshona. You have given a spirit that once you see something you Ref, go for it. Refilwe moya wa ha o bona silo ya silata le go o tshutshetswa o ba a uwa. Revelation of awareness. Kutullo ya ru le moghe ka momogopolo. Tells you who you are and where you are going. It tells us that you are now ru ya ka ye no mang. Revelation of awareness. Kutullo ya ru le moghe. Out of your mind. Ka ra mogopolo wa hao. Tells you who you are. E botsa wena ru mang. And where you are going. O ru ya ka ye ha pe ga bedi. Listen the problem is we don't know who are we. Tseletsa ba botata re tsitse bo re re bo mang. So our minds are bringing a lot of interpretation. Me gopolo ya rena itisa di thaloso tse di ngata tsa wa affect. There are certain things we don't want to entangle them. Re na lona le tse di ngata re nya go di challenge ra tsena ka ra tsona. Ta ba shi re na le boipoifo. We become people who are afraid. Re thomo ba batho ba o dula ba tshabile. Of useless things. Re tshaba di nto tsa o thoka me gola. I don't know if you hear it. Nke tsebe ga le ntwa. As the says, which shall I call for? What is it that come first? King, ye fit and peel, me go pull on one hour, na go chow chow. If it's negative, it has to be played. Highly cherished, John. I did not know when I would love be like that. If it is negative, highly cherished, John. It makes you to confess. Did not know when I would be like that. Things which are not worthy for you. Then touch it, it's all so unlearned. Now you understand that delay. Don't only a question or two, and I go. Been caused by anybody around. I want the rock and motor. No one can feel it. Let now, but see him to go. Delay is here. Ochi anako ukamoto ho ukamo mukhopulo nwa ha because if your mind is right ka re mukhopulo wa ga o lukile le modimo think like god o to nna gana o swana le modimo that's why bible say you've got mind of christ that's why bible re na le mukhopulo wa christ read that verse again are ba leng verse ye la habedi for god did not give us a spirit of timidity or cowardice or fear but he has given us a spirit of power and of love and of sound judgment and personal discipline abilities that res- result in a calm well balanced mind and self control now you can see that your mind jana re a bona re me go bolo ya rena start to be active when you are challenged e thoma o ye ma ya shuma ha o shishinywa your mind mo go bolo wa ha start to be active o thoma o yema ha wena o shishinywa a child of god mwana wa modimo was not facing a challenge ya sakopane le o shishinywa is having a dead mind e ona le mogopolo o shileng because now a challenge jwa no challenge 
need your reflections. He just need you to act according to what you know. Which you have been given from the word of God. What you have been given from the word of God, you put it in your mind. So when you are challenged, what has been stored in your mind must be applied. So we know you application of the principle you put in your mind. We know you the principle that you put in your mind. Reaction. Reaction. Tell us that you put something here. Normally, Normally, a Christian is not supposed to react. A, a, Christian, is a, a Christian of action. We don't wait. To we are always ready to do something. If you believe, say amen. Let's read Hebrews 11, verse 1. By verse 11, verse 1. Yes. Now, faith is the assurance, meaning title deed, confirmation of things hoped for, divinely guaranteed, and the evidence of things not seen, the conviction of their reality. Faith comprehends as fact what cannot be experienced by the physical senses. Faith comprehends faith comprehends what as fact what cannot be explained in other words you cannot apply what you don't have in your mind the moment when you understand that all oh, faith is assurance. You cannot talk about something that you didn't put in your mind. Without faith, your mind does not exist. The right mind from God. Without faith, the right mind from God does not exist in you. Can you see that? Because when you are when you are challenged, whatever you are seeing, it needs what it needs your mind. It needs your mind. It needs your mind. And what is coming out and then it I'm not supposed why people react. It's after you build up things. There are some characters that you normally show. Because you cook them in your mind. But a child of God will always have hope that the, that the moment when he's challenged he cannot change his position because faith is assurance faith is assurance assurance is what is like a will so that will must be written in your you will this will happen when you see negative you look at it and laugh at it because <laughs> there's something here. You say, I'm seeing it but there's something written in my mind. what I can express. I express what is written in my mind. What Satan is bringing. In my mind I have a role. In my mind I have a role. In my mind I can see what is written in my mind. What other people do not see. So therefore I cannot be challenged by the physical sense when I have put something here that cannot be seen which is what God is telling me of where I'm going if I, you hear say I hear. 
Do you hear what I'm trying to say? I'm trying to look at your mind. I found that you put a lot of things which are checking for your for your senses. And you forget that there is something you can hear which can tell the feelings, the surroundings, the challenges, the challenges, the shame around you. I don't know if you're hearing me. Christians, they don't go by feelings. By physical senses. They go by what they put in their mind. I go by what I put in their mind. Not by what I'm having. There's something I put in their mind. The mind is an asset. There's something that God has to use to give you what you need and to bring you to a place of existence. I was looking at this verse of Ephesians 3 verse 20 which is like a very challenging verse to us. God is able to do above what we think. In other words, God looks at in your mind, he brings the reasons. Your, your mind is there to think the limitations of what God wants to do. Is there to draw a line? Is there just to throw a line? Can you see that your mind draws a line? I don't know if you are hearing it. In other words, your mind does like this. It draws a line. When God looks at you, He looks at you at your mind. Your mind is extended extended by the word of God. Your line is drawn like this. And God gave you this. So look here. If now your mind is on Christ of the world, you draw the mind of where God is. Even when people are thinking small of you, you because your mind is there to draw. I don't know if you're hearing me. Let me show you by three people. Look here. Can you stand like that? Face Your mind is there. So this man, this one is his mind. This one is his mind. This one is the mind of Christ. So if this man is thinking to reach here, God will do here. Amen. So if your mind is not extended to reach you, you are affected on what God wants to give you. Which is really designed or tailor made for you. Oh, look at this. Okay. You are here. His mind is thinking to reach here. You don't deal with your mind. It is possible you die here. We are gonna allow no hella namo. You can still celebrate when you are here. Where you can not celebrate. Also, let me go and do that. Me love you, Kwale. I don't know if you hear me. I get some lint. But when you deal with your mind, don't know how you should manage. Let me go pull over how. And your mind reaches here. And let me go pull over how you fit. You understand that your mind reaches here. What can we do? No, 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 no. Or no, 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 no. Or no, 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 no. Or no, 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 no. Believe in my mind. I want the mind of what? Of the word of God. When you reach here, that's where God is. Do you hear what I'm saying? 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 God want to make you what you want to make you. I say now it's not according to your ability. It's according to what I've created. God bless you. 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 
There are things in life that God will never give you until you jumped out of your mind and put what God says concerning you. He enhance your mind and bring your mind to a place where he wants you to be. It's why he created you to be what he wants to be. It is not yet late. It is too early for you. God is expecting you to deal with your mind. If you believe, say it. Let me show you another scripture. Because it seems as if I'm talking too much. If I talk too much, I will end up like a teacher. I don't want to teach. Okay, good. Look at this verse, um, Luke 10. Verse 38. Now while they were on their way, Jesus entered a village called Bethany. And a woman named Martha welcomed him into her home. She had a sister named Mary who seated herself at the Lord's feet and was continually listening to his teaching. But Martha was very busy and distracted with all of her serving responsibilities. And she approached him and said, Lord, is it of no consent to you that my sister has left me to do the serving alone? Tell her to help me and do her part. But the Lord replied to her, Martha, Martha, you are worried and bothered and anxious about so many things. But only one thing is necessary for Mary has chosen the good part, that which is to her advantage, which will not be taken away from her. Can you see here Jesus was Seeing the the reason of what is happening in us today. This is a lesson that is what is happening now. Martha, Martha was busy working using what she can do. She came with all her abilities but she could not satisfy the Lord. If you ever find that you are busy doing this and that but you are not here Even what you are doing is going to distract you. you. You can be busy doing things. If you, 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 you don't have the word of God, you, you distract yourself. yourself. So Jesus said, sorry. Mary has chosen the best. She wants to do things by what she's hearing from God. That's what Jesus was saying here. This is a teaching to us today. This woman could not understand what Jesus was saying. We have to understand this. Because this is written for us. You are busy doing something. And it's also even distracting you. If you are distracting you, want help. Can I tell you this? If you are doing something out of your mind, soon you will complain. complain. Soon you will paint things. But if it's out from God, you don't need anybody to help. You are going to blame people why they are not helping you. 
Because you have reached to the limit. Of your mind. When you look at others you pray them. Why are they not doing this? Get up from your when mind. Because when in your mind. You are in your flesh. If your mind doesn't have the way. You are pointing fingers. At others becomes your portion. I don't know if you are hearing So, Jesus said, no, Mary has chosen the best part. She wants to sit on my feet and hear the word better than you. This is setting. Distracted by what you think. I don't know if you are hearing this. If truly you are saving the house of God. How do you know you are saving? From the Holy Spirit. It's when you don't care who's there. But if you are using your man. Don't allow your man. To confuse you. To say, you see, other people are not doing what you want. If you bring the word of God, if you bring the word of God, how can this salin chila mudim? The spirit of God will make you to have focus. My own mudim mota diyoro wena uveli mo uli veli ching. He was distracted. Yeah, and she want chilenga shitelwan. His focus is affected. Ma uli veli ching wana we affected ya. Truly, when you allow your mind to be saturated by the word of God, you will never be distracted. You will never be confused. You will be focused. You will never be confused. You will never be confused. You will be focused. You will never be confused. Martha was supposed to be focused. Martha na chunjo ba bo na libeleji abone tabe idirongi Maria ye. If you know you are enjoying what you are doing, you don't care who's there. I don't know if you are hearing me. Do you care who's there? You enjoy what you are doing. You carry on with what you are doing. You don't know who's there. You carry on with what you are doing. You don't know what is happening. 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 When I reach home, Mama said, "You pray for someone like this." Ah, Mama, I go now. Rapele, you must tell me what I'm doing. Was wearing this and this. Nah, peri seli seli sela. Me, I didn't even see that. Nah, kai bon. I always ask myself, why I didn't see what Mama was saying. Yano nki toi putisoro why ki sabona ndrela Mama na bayi bolen. Because I'm focused in your spiritual life. Kau bane ki libele chibu pilongbali na basumo ya. I cannot be distracted by what you are wearing. I don't know if you are hearing me. So Jesus says, so Jesus says, Mary has chosen the best. Maria uchetile karlo ekaone. Because she wants to hear the word of. Kaure unyoko tuali nchi la modi. She doesn't want distraction. Listen. Anya kuchetele wani. I have seen many people. Even in charities, I see. Limo charities, even in charities, we have been preaching. Obola anke khale selare ralinchi. I have seen Christians started to serve God soon their time. Kibo na ba puluswa ba tangela modi misi khale ba ataki. It's because they are saving God. Tabashi. A plan. Ba tangela modi mo na linto ba ilibeli ching. They are saving God, looking at something. Ba tangela modi mo e marona linto ba ilibeli ching. They are using their mind. Ba shimisha me kopolo ya bon. The work of God is not mura bara. Mushuma modi mo asim mura bara. The work of God is not mura. Ango buta mo chalo kaofi. Mushuma modi mo asim mura bara. You cannot get tired. Wakasa khatale. When you are busy doing things. How le busy dia dilo. With a sound mind. Kamu kopolo o do di shailing. If you are you are doing things with a sound mind. How dira you won't be tired. I don't know if you are hearing me. You cannot be tired. When you are doing something with the sound man. I'm not surprised. You are tired now. Oh, you are tired now. Before even God rewards you. If you read First Corinthians 15, verse 28. It shows that your labour will not be in vain. Your labour will never be in vain. If you serve God with a sound mind, you will never be in vain. If you serve God with a sound mind. How thank you, Lord. And you carry on with the right hand. What the pill? Like a mohopolo, you swallow it. It's hard. You will see the result. What about my people? So we just read that verse, man. Are you believing verse eleven? First Corinthians. Ma Corinthians, ma pill. Fifteen. Fifteen. Fifty-eight. Fifty-eight. 
it says, Therefore, my beloved brothers and sisters, be steadfast, immovable, always excelling in the work of the Lord, always doing your best and doing more than is needed, being continually aware that your labor, even to the point of exhaustion, in the Lord is not futile nor wasted. It is never without purpose. Did you hear that verse? I went to another church, but I won't mention, but some people who are here, they will know. I saw this farmer. In an old age, she can still be MC. <laughs> you know, she can still clean the, the house of without, without looking. She wake up. She go to church. She do this. I do that. I was looking. I said, God, what happened to this woman? I realize she has dealt with a man. You know, once you deal with your mother, you don't care, is there any youth? Who's what is there? Otherwise, you will be disappointed. Do you know why you get disappointment? You have concluded with your mind. You, you reach a level where you conclude. And she shall go with his mind. Or oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. oh, yeah. oh, yeah. If I want to serve God, I'm going to be steadfast. What the Bible says, be steadfast. Because on the way you will be challenged. There are tough times. It says, be immovable. There are things that are coming to change there are things that are there to shake you. Especially in Charis. In Charis, if you are saving God, ah, they will never leave. They will never leave. You, you know, there's a gossip. There are some Christians who are just coming to If you don't deal with your man, you don't have to deal with your man. The moment when you hear stories, you are going to be very tired. I don't know if you hear it. Can you read that verse again? Let's start from that verse. Line to the bottom of the line. Line to the bottom. Therefore, my brothers and sisters, uh, be steadfast, uh, immovable, uh, always excelling in the work of the Lord. Stop there. You cannot do the work of God with a mind that is attacked. A mind that is affected. Deal with your mind. Tell me, but deal with your Soon mind. Soon you will be tired. Soon you will be tired. Soon you are going to you find yourself changing what you do before. Changing. If you don't reach a level where people say you are stupid, you are not saving God. You are not saving God. You are not saving God. You will hear stories that have to alter your decisions. You are not saving God. You are not saving I'm doing this. It's like I'm doing this. My husband is doing it. It's like I'm a fish. Carry all doing it. In the right mind. I don't know if you're hearing me. You won't stop and you won't start anything without a challenge. It will reach you here. Carry all doing it. Ah, no, there are Christians who just come to church. Carry all doing it. 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 They go around with a tissue. Roll it. 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 Roll it.
out of their purse. Ye chaka ra person try on. Ba pumula si chile ya bona ye buti buti ba dula. You won't have a challenge. Ah, oka si beli challenge ya bupi. The people is in the church. Ntry ka ranto ya mudi. It's not outside of. Ayo oka nte. It's in the church. Ika ranga kuamre. I don't know if you hear me. Aki tsema lento. You won't know the battle. Oka si beli enter the church. Au fita uze na kaha. Ntry ka hare. Satan send his people. Satan usrume la bagaye ba to ka hare. Christians are in the church. Ba pulu suba ka hariya kereke. Satan o rumela liba haye ka hari. Deal with your mind. When I wish man a fella li mo flow. How to man drong us katuela. And don't allow your mind. And as katumela mo kupula wa hau. Who fit supatila? Ye ta affect tang moya wa hau. Because when you are going to pray. Kalo ba kalo how you rapela. Mo kupula wa hau usanali. A page, little paper, from a book. When you are going to pray, how your rappella? You see, the wrong page will be open. Wah, when a page is in your name, abule. And you will struggle in your prayer. Why so call a karatapel? So make sure that in everything, in the book of your book, karabuka ye la ya hau ya mukopolo. What you are writing, Jehudi mwadi lengi. It's from the Bible. It's not situation. It's not what they did. It's not in touch about the language or nani. Kaubani mukopolo wa hau sana libuka. Where things are being written. Modi todi mwaluante ngi. Do you want to say? Le ikwata ba ye. Let me give an example why. Ereke le fengu talamulato. When someone die, how much more to go far? Before you bury the person, le so you muluka. You open the coffin. Le bola ntoe la bariki coffin le poki. Do you know why? Let's go malato. Can I tell you why? Kile talusech. Eh? Hmm. Do you know why? Le atiba. Because in your mind, kabane mohopolo wale na. Your mind itself, mohopolo wona kabu wona. It have got a pen. Ona le ball pen, ntoe unwala. That right in your mind. Ya unwala ana muka ara mukopol. In your mind. Kara mukopol. And then now. Jano. Whatever that is right written there. Kamu kache unwadi lo enga na mowe mukopolong. You cannot remove it until you see. O kasi di tu show fitela ubo na. If you don't see that person. Ao saboni mutola. It's still written there. You dream. Usa unwadi lo tata umulo rai bilabiri. Because in your mind here, there are things which are like memorials. You must see the way you are going. And when it's painful to the people, what is written here? That's why you are bound to cry. You are not crying because this person is dead. You are crying because you are not crying because this person is dead. You are crying because you are not crying because this person is dead. You are crying because you are not crying because this person is dead. You are crying because you are not crying because this person is dead. You are crying because you are not crying because this person is dead. You are crying because you are not crying because this person is dead. You find they're still gossiping. Oto la basa se baba ba wana ukuwe mahu. When other people are crying, baba ngoban chiba la mola ba duchi mola. Baba ngoban le abona. Abona tu pisele wa paroki ula. Isorali ya magret. Isorali ya magret. Mara this coffin. It's because tabashi. Nothing is written. The awanantu ingwadi lo ingoto hong. I don't know if you're hearing. Mungetse ba lento. If there's check around. Ha ili kona lubela. Something is written. Ha ona lento ingwadi lo ingoto hong. You will see some people crying. Ota bana ba ngoban. Because they are trying to remove what their mind is in their mind. The pain of the mind. Not to remove it. And whatever is written in your mind, it must be what is written in your mind. It brings out pictures. It brings out pictures. Now you begin to see so, in reality. So for you to cancel that you so must also see. If you believe so. Let's read uh, Romans chapter 1. Romans chapter 1. Verse 16. Verse 16. Mm. Verse 16. Verse 16. Mm. Verse 16. I'm sure today there are things you are going to remove, isn't it? And do not be conformed to this world any longer with its superficial values and customs, but be transformed and progressively changed as you mature spiritually by the renewing of your mind. 
focusing on your godly values and ethical attitude so that stop there mama focusing on focusing on godly values and ethical attitudes can you hear that Leigua. Focusing on godly values. And and ethical attitudes. Do, do, do not be, be transformed from just read, do not be conformed to the world. Do not be conformed to this world. Uh-huh. Any longer with its superficial values and customs. In this world, it has got its own values. It has got its own values. It has got its own values. But be transformed and progressively changed. My God. Can you see that? Those things which are important here, which the people are looking at, be delivered from them. And look at the ethical. Look at the godly character look at what pleases god because these things that the world is looking at is there also to distract you is there to change your mind be transformed be delivered come out from the value superficial why the Bible says super, is this superficial let's check there superficial values progressively change as mature and spiritually superficial things superficial is things that of the world which the world sees it getting to it you can see that we are the one you know uh, i can give an example by a car you know when you are driving a car you look at the dashboard you go around the car you look at the lights and you look around it's so beautiful isn't it let's remove the covering look at the engine the one word it's not even nice isn't it look at the dashboard remove it what, what dies is it's not what you are seeing. What does is this one that is inside? If you look at this thing, outside, it can rob you. And you find that you think it won't die. You can still have the outward and the beauty of it. And you are enjoying the outward. Why chin inside the outside? Remove the engine. What is outside? Can only be inside. Where the sun is shining. 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 It looks like it's having value in you this world. You look beyond that because this dies. We are wasting time on what dies than what is needed. Which is your spirit must have a character. Ethical values. Ethical values. Our mind is busy on what is it that we can make. We are so busy. We are busy. I pray that today. We deal with our mind. Let's change how we think. Read that verse 2 again. Mama. Read that verse 2. Read that verse 2. 
are you a to have? And do not be conformed to this world. Can you hear that? Amen. That word to be conformed. Oh, my son. Don't, don't allow the world to, to be part of you. I don't know if you're hearing it. So you don't be conformed. Be transformed. There are certain things that you cannot do because it's done by the people of the world. It must be recorded in your mind. I cannot gossip. It must be recorded I cannot talk about the I cannot compete. I have to make sure that my mind is pure. Is pure. I think the word of God. I do what the Bible says. I walk by the word of God. If you are hearing me say, I am. How many of you believe today is your day? How is your mind? Think about Colossians 3. Verse 2. Verse 2. It says, set your mind above. I'll be finishing now. Amen. Colossians chapter 3 2. Chapter 3, Revelation verse 2. Uh-huh. It says, Set your mind and keep focused habitually on the things above, meaning the heavenly things, not on things that are on the earth, which have only temporal value. Did you hear that? A car is a bit temporal. When the Bible says things that are on the earth, it's including us. You are, you are in the world, isn't it? Things that on the earth, can you see this? Can you see this? Can you see this? Can you see yourself? The Bible says we must not think about each other in a wrong way. Read that verse again, man. Let's, let's read that verse. It's important. Set your mind and keep focused habitually on the things above. Thank you. Thank you. That verse it says, keep focused habitually on the things above. Carry on reading. And says, above is the heavenly things, not on things that are on the earth, which have only temporal value. Did you hear that? What is it? Ask your name. What is it that is really a desire of your heart? You you always think about. About. You know, it says temporal value. I remember uh, when I, I started the ministry. I can tell you that everything that is happening to all of us is temporal. I have prayed and prayed and prayed. Things were not changed. I prayed until I adjust myself that it's not what I need that will make me to go to heaven. I must focus myself and live life to please God. I call my wife mama. we must forget about the things of the world. Let's preach the gospel whether we don't have money or not whether we have food or not we start to have this issue of of saying we have lunch time we go and sit where the table is empty and we sit and say mama it's time to eat. 
we begin to thank God for the food. When the food is not there, thank God for the food. Thank you, Lord. We have eaten and we stood up and we go in the evening. We begin to leave. We end up forgetting this food. We begin to, you know, because it's what you put in your mouth. That reminds you. If, if you are on fasting, what makes you to break fasting is because you'll be thinking about food. Just say, hey, Sometimes when you are walking, you know, you know, you know, this this thing happened. You find that you, you say you want to do fasting. You spend three days. The first day, Satan won't worry about you. But by the second day, Satan will give money to your neighbor. Satan will give money to your neighbor. You have never had maki cooking meat or had the smell. 11 o'clock. 11 o'clock in the afternoon. When you are passing like this, how do you think you are eating? You start hearing the smell of good food. The second day, I catch a chilabu bedi. You, you, you'll be seeing your neighbor. Udlo bana magi. Going out like this. I just come home. Calling his own dog. Huh? I be jam say hi. I from a rapper. Giving he his her dog bones of meat. I say Swariki, Swariki. Uh, and you are passing the name of the dog. And he, when I want feed, and you are hungry, and on Surikitan, because remember that Opala. what gives you to think is what is written here. It's time to eat. 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 I know many people can do say fasting for seven days. But the third day says, ah, but God has had me already. God has had me already. Because the fight is here. The fight is here. God has had me. God has had me. God cannot allow me to go through this so that I can be thin like this. Satan will start to show you your feet. The devil will start to show you how. And say, sometimes you'll be surprised you are standing in front of a mirror. And you will be like this. I don't know what you are saying. I don't know what you are saying. Hey, it's like I'm going down. My cave is running away. Satan will tell you, you see, you will die. Ah, now God has heard my prayers. Satan will just preach to you. Satan will always preach. Say now. What about if you just don't eat? Go for the evening food. Eat soft food. Don't eat too much. After you eat in the morning, Hannah will come with this power. Because you have reported food now. You will hear eggs being fried. And Satan will show you this. Satan will show you this. That's the reason why people they don't fast. That is why It's because of their mind. If we don't deal with our mind, there are things we will never break. There are things we will never do. I don't know if you hear me. Let's deal with our mind. Let's go to the bush. When I'm there, there's issues of this mind. 
I began I just want to teach you so that you do this. Ke nona go le ruta fela gore le dire ta bae. I began to project my mind. Ka thomo ntsha mogopolo wa ka. You know, I remove my mind from what I know in the world. Ka to sha mogopolo wa ka wa dilo tshe ke ditsebang le fatseng. I began to say I'm in heaven. Ka thomo ra wa jwana ke le godimong. Here there are angels. Mo ona le marong wa fela. So soon I'll see angels. Jwana ke se khale ke tabona marong. Soon I'll see someone there. Ese khale ke tabona o karona le motho mola. Who's coming here? Who ta ken? When I'm looking at that person is here. Ha ke le bele tshe motho ono se tsha fitile mo. Because I know that in heaven when there's no speed. Ke atse bona le go le go di monga ona le bilo. I'm looking at that person there. Ke bona motho a le kwale. I've dealt with my mind. Ke shumane le mogopolo wa kana mo le ntwa. If you want to see things in How nya ko bona di lo di tswalela moyeng shumana le mogopolo pele. Deal with your mind. I shumana le mogopolo wa hao ke to le balela yona ka ra le ntjela motho. And I will close the veil. Ke atswalela. Deal with your mind. Ngo shumana le mogopolo. When I project. Ha na jo nong ke bia mona ha no waka. And see myself. Ka thoma o te bona ke le go dimong. Everything talks. Ka mo ka di lo tia bolela ka o fela di lo tia phila. When the grass is dry like. Ah ma jo nga thomo di ka mogho. Uh, to me it's like they are singing you are holy i begin to you are holy so time is going when, I, when my mind seems to be like i begin to pray i begin to pray i begin to pray i don't want my mind to give me a direction i'm in a fast day i don't want to be distracted so i put my mind and i say god is somewhere you know There was a time where if I tell you this you won't understand it. There was a time when I didn't want to look up. This has changed how I walk. Ndoi chenchi se 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 mo ho ho ka wa sipi. Ha le ka mpona ke sipela ke sipela ke lebele tshe fase mitai. Ke dula ke lebele tshe fase. Because when I When I do like this I'll be seeing Ka bona ha ke re ke lebella go dimo ke to bona motho mongwa du tshe situlong kai kai go dimo And my heart will be telling me I must And a pulu ya ka jona nge e tore nda ke nyoko bona sifateo Even when I want to see the face of Le ke re ke nyoko bona sifateo Why because ke lebella fase ka hore I have dealt with my mind ke ile ka shumana le mogopolo wa ka I don't know if you hear me. Deal with your mind. Shumana le mihopolo ya hao. Your spiritual life. Mbopilo ba oba simoya. Will be so big. Buta ba bo bogolo. Will connect you with the one. Buta u connect ali o la u tuji. Let me show you from the script. Eri kile bonche nkara le ntshela modimo. This script is going to help. Le ngwalo le le tata le rithusha. Hallelujah. Amen. Is then I will close here. Sorry mama. Ke ta khona ke tswalela. After I read the script I will close. Kamara wa oba la le ntshile. Romans 8. Maroma 8 verse 5 verse 5 Listen to that verse if you don't have the Bible. Next I was in the Bible. Na go eta le tele di Bible cha le. Maroma 8 verse 5. 80 are vale verse 5. It says For those who are living according to the flesh set their minds on the things of the flesh which gratify the body. But those who are living according to the spirit set their minds on the things of the spirit meaning his will and purpose. Did you hear that? Likwile. You can be able to deal with your mind. O ka khona o shumana le mogopolo wa. If your focus is in the flesh. Ha wena o lebeletse na meng. It's for the benefit of your body. O diela ro khule ena me. This body will die well. Me lo to khwa segale. Read that verse again mama. Ari baleng habe di vesela. Verse 6. Yes. Now the mind of the flesh is death both now and forever because it pursues sin. But the mind of the spirit is life and peace, the spiritual well-being that comes from the walking with God both now and forever. Yeah. Ba ulibeji. So deal with your mind. No, no, shumana le buen. Fix it for Christ. Lukisha u lukisha Christ. Where you are going. Mo yang ona le hodimo. God loves you. Hodimo wa urata. Hallelujah. Can you see? When I look around, I can see some of you you didn't sleep. Ba ke le bela ke bona ba bangwe ba rena re a robala. Calculating with your mind. Re a bala re bala ka me na no ya rena. 
If God tells you that you are left with two years to live. This thing in your mind you will see that they are useless. The rich man after he became rich he told himself with his mind I will destroy these birds and turn it and put whatever that I have got and harvest his grapes you found him when you were still thinking you found his request so who is going to enjoy this? I pray that today. We don't value life the way we see. We value life the way God wants to see. Take the scriptures. So that we think the way. We don't have to think the way. We don't have to think the way. We don't have to think the way. God wants us to think. Are you ready to do that? Are you ready to do that? If a problem is difficult, don't entertain it, leave it to God. Deal with your mind and make sure that you don't think about wrong things. Because your time here is not enough. Your time here is few. Whatever is born is dead. God bless you. God bless you.